hey guys it's your girl patience here and thank you so much for watching this video so on this video guys like i'm just gonna be take, talking about something you need to take no, note of in your 20s right so like um i'm just kind of an inquisitive person so at times when i meet people who inspire me or some people who like i adore and they're older than me i always just get to ask for general advice or i even ask them what are some of the things they really wish they had known in their what in their early 20s right so like reason why i'm doing this video is because like i'm just like approaching my mid-20s and then most of my colleagues are in their 20s so i've just really seen this trend like most of us we get to be depressed some of us we just like giving up and then we're thinking like we have just failed in life and everything right so like most of us are just in that position in life where you just think like yeah and nobody or you don't amount to anything or hope is gone and everything right and we are just in our 20s like i mean come on we're just in our 20s like this is when we are supposed to be just like exploring in life this is the time to just like explore life and everything because we are still young adults remember and we don't really have a whole lot of responsibilities but if you really check the check the statistics the depression statistics how many the suicidal rates and everything like you just find like most of us in our 20s we're already messed up some of us we just like giving up and everything right so here are some of the things that you really need to take note of in your 20s and by the way the reason why i always usually ask people who are older than me is that i have learned that you can't make all the mistakes like come on people say we learn from mistakes and experiences and from a whole different other sources right but talking about mistakes and experiences like i'm not gonna be able to make all the mistakes i'm not gonna be able to experience everything right so i would rather avoid as many mistakes as possible by learning from what from the mistakes other people have made so they have made mistakes and they have learned and so i can learn from them so they made the mistake on my behalf right so just take advantage of that like other people made the mistake on your behalf <laughs> okay so right like just learn from them right and then once you learn always sit down and take note of what works for you i mean like not all our advice is gonna work for everyone because we are different people with different personalities so it's very important to check what kind of an individual are you and what kind of what kind of goals are you having what kind of dreams are you having and is it gonna work for you right like so take note of that but there are obviously some things that are really general right so the first thing that you really need to take note of is because maybe when we are in the teenage years you know growing up we just think life is all gonna be what milk and honey right and then we have all these dreams on paper all these goals we having and then when you get to be maybe you have a goal to accomplish by 22 25 30 and then you realize like time is just moving and i i won't be able to do it in time like you know like or finish by the time i want it right and you start to be getting depressed and start to feel as failures number one thing you have to take note of is life is gonna be full of surprises come on like you have to take note of that life is gonna be full of surprises so it's up to you to you know react and have that positive attitude when you find yourself in that in those situations right so number one thing you always have to take note of this if things that you have, you have put on paper are not you know going as planned it doesn't mean you are a failure it doesn't mean you are a nobody it doesn't mean you don't amount to anything right it, it, it's just like it's just life it's full of surprises so pick yourself up rise up and you keep on going guys this is the time to explore this is the time to experience that's part of the experience you not accomplishing some of the things you thought you have accomplished because maybe you, most of us will be like by 25 i'll be married and having a house and you know like having a car and a job others will be like my businesses will be flourishing and everything and then by 25 none of that is even showing you know and then so you just feel like okay I can't I can't you can't say that there's still more to life you're just in your 20s 
Number two thing to take note of is because we're usually comparing ourselves with our colleagues. We compare ourselves, you know, with our classmates, with our previous high school mates and all those people and our current colleagues. We are comparing ourselves with them. And because we're comparing ourselves, we just have that pressure like maybe I'm not working enough. Maybe I'm a failure. Why is it others my age are making it, you know? You might find that maybe your next colleague or the next person, you know, the person right next to you is just living that life you have on paper. And and you, you just can't seem to be accomplishing that it doesn't mean you have failed right come on it's just like you're working in your own time frame so keep on remain determined remain focused work on your life stop comparing yourself that much I know it's very difficult I know it's very difficult to we can't just like write it off like that but work on it work on it bit by bit learn to stop comparing yourself with your other colleagues right then that's the number two thing right then one of the most crucial things to take note of is the freedom we get in our 20s i think like this should be a whole topic for another new day the freedom that comes with that like most of us we are in colleges most of us we start living alone and everything and we have this whole freedom and we don't have a whole lot of responsibilities most of us won't be married won't be having babies and everything so we don't have as many responsibilities so you just a free being and that's the time we make a lot of mistakes because of the freedom we tend to misuse the freedom so do not misuse the freedom that you get in your 20s use the time wisely use that time to invest in yourself right i know a lot of us will be having fun in everything out there it's okay to have fun but that doesn't mean that's the sole purpose you know because if you misuse that freedom it's gonna catch up with you the things that you're supposed to do in your 20s you're gonna start doing them in your 30s meaning you start gonna be building your life in your 30s right so guys just like i was advised start working on your life in your 20s because you're the navigator like navigate your life you know like you're in the driver's seat so as you're driving your life make sure like you start it as early as possible i remember actually interviewing my sister would come from davos i would just put the video like um you see the video yeah somewhere there it will appear if you're maybe watching this on facebook you can check the video on youtube like i post videos on youtube so you can also check that video on youtube and she said that when they were there in devils right and then they were talking it's a world annual economic forum thing so like when she was talking to you they, they had an opportunity to sit down with jack ma jack ma was like in your 20s it's the time if you don't know Jack Ma, please Google him. Ne? It's the time you say that in your 20s is the time to acquire as many skills as possible. As many skills as possible. This is the time to acquire skills, perfect skills, you know that. And then in your 30s, start putting them to work and all that. It's another topic for another day. Then some things you do in your 40s. But this is the time, guys, for you to just have as many skills as possible. Try things, fail at others do something else try businesses fail do something else you know like just acquire skills as many as possible invest yours in yourself you know like really really invest in yourself guys like invest in yourself in your 20s because you're already laying the foundation you know if you don't in your 30s you're gonna start investing in yourself and already you're falling behind time so if you're in your 20s and you're watching this start investing in yourself this is the time to find the areas you're interested in when it comes to life you know the areas you can explore what you love doing and all that you know so take time in your 20s in you know, order to just discover yourself discover who you are never think you are a failure there is still more to life stop comparing yourself know that it's not always gonna be milk and honey that you put on paper when you're like 15 you know that so guys there is more to this video there's a it's already like almost nine minutes so i'm gonna make a part two of this video because there is a whole lot of things we can discuss about in your 20s this is the time when most people will give up on relationships because they will be having heartbreaks this is the time most people will make some mistakes and then they will be like i now have babies and everything so thank you so much for watching this video watch out for part two of this video share with others if you like it subscribe to my channel thank you all those you have supporting been supporting me from the start until today thank you bye till next time Toodles. cheers